And today we're looking at the difference between two of Ping's current irons, the G20 and the I-15. Uh, two different types of clubs, the I-15, if I show you the difference between the two, the I-15 as you can see has got a lot thinner sole, thinner leading edge than the G20. A little bit smaller, more compact head as well. And then the G20, obviously very wide sole, deep cavity, thicker lead and edge. A lot more forgiving. So you've got the G20 club, which is going to get the ball up in the air. It's a very forgiving club, aimed at sort of a mid handicapper, very, very forgiving. Designed for distance, uh, seven irons, which we've got here. Uh, 32 degrees in the G20 and 33 degrees in the I-15. So the I-15 one degree weaker throughout the range. Obviously that can be amended accordingly if you want them made stronger, not a problem. Uh, but the G20 is designed to hit it a long way and uh, obviously get the ball up in the air. So if we just try it. Looks very nice and forgiving at a dress, a uh, very big head, you know, looks very easy to hit. Yeah, very high launching club. Um, so very, very forgiving, high launching, carry the ball as far as possible, so it's very, very forgiving. And with the I-15, obviously different sort of technology, more designed towards a mid-low handicapper, as you can see, a dress a lot smaller. You know, the head, target area is a lot smaller. So no forgiveness really in comparison to the G20. Thinner leading edge, a lot more appealing to the eye. You know, sits nicer behind the ball. You know, sits a lot squarer. Playability available, obviously. You know, you're going to be able to work the ball with the I-15 a lot more than with the G20. And a lower launch, you know, mid-launch. So not a very, very low launch, you know, there's still forgiveness in the club as there are through, you know, Ping's range in general, but there's not an awful lot of forgiveness in comparison to the G20. So if you're looking for something that's going to give you forgiveness, get the ball up in the air, then the G20 club with this deep cavity, wide sole, you know, thicker, more forgiving head is going to be perfect. And then if you want something that's going to be more playable than the I-15. Obviously you can see their thinner sole, thinner leading edge, target areas. If we compare the two, you can see it's a lot more compact, the I-15. And that sums up uh, today. Any more questions or any queries, please don't hesitate to contact us at golfbyitonline.com. Thank you very much for listening.